Navigation bronchoscopy allows us to make a diagnosis uh, for a patient very early in their disease and early detection of lung cancer results in a much higher cure rate. We're using the newest version of a Medtronic product that is the only system that really allows us to have real-time assessment of where we are within the lung. Once we reach the desired location within the lung, I will have a picture on the screen not only of where I am in the lung, but also a computer-generated target that will move as the patient breathes or as I move the instruments to make sure that I'm actually pointing at the target that I'm trying to biopsy. A lot of times people hear the word robotic and they think that is the best technology out. But there are some downsides to robotic procedures. For instance, robotic bronchoscopy takes on average about an hour and a half or longer to do the same procedure that we can do here in about 45 minutes. One of the most important characteristics of any technology is what its diagnostic yield is, which is what percentage of the patients that have the procedure actually get a diagnosis. And using the current system that we have, where we've been able to get a very high diagnostic yield in the higher than 90% range, while some of the other technologies, including the robotic technologies, have published success rates below 70%. In this particular situation, at least in the current setting, the technology that we're using here in Bozeman is the state of the art and allows us to get very high diagnostic yields in the shortest duration procedure possible.